All new at 10 o'clock, something brand new is coming to the iconic spot in downtown Dallas you may be familiar with. After a million dollar renovation, Fountain Place Tower is going to be opening an exclusive club. They got hopes of drawing new companies and office workers back downtown. Our Aaron Jones tonight has your look at the future. If John Hinckley is not at home or work, you can find him at members only social clubs in Dallas. I've been a member of private social clubs for the last three or four years. Um, and I think the draw was to be a part of a social group where you can go out and, uh, you know, outside of a, a restaurant, you could go and hang out with friends in a private setting. Um, that's kind of unique. Many are focused on socializing, but following a $70 million renovation, Fountain Place in downtown Dallas is preparing to introduce a unique take aimed at enriching the office environment while working to revitalize the area. In a post pandemic world, um, employers that lease space in our office, uh, they're looking for ways to attract uh, existing employees and also to attract and hire. Uh, new talent, and to do so, they need to offer more amenities. That's the name of the game. Goddard Investment Group, which owns the skyscraper, says Cypress at Fountain Place will redefine the office workplace experience. The 13,000 square foot space will offer new features and amenities like chef driven food and beverage, indoor and outdoor pickleball courts, a hunting simulator, and golf simulator. You'll find some of those elements in other parts of the uh, downtown Dallas, but we're the only place that offers everything under one roof. We will be the first of its kind in the market. Opening next summer, membership will be available to tenants in this building as well as community members by invitation only. The pricing structure is still being determined. I can just say from my, my side, in, in today's work world, I think that's what you know uh, people in the business world are looking for is not just an office space. Hinkley believes this is what downtown Dallas is missing. As someone who does business here, he's looking forward to seeing the impact it has. In Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS News, Texas.